What's up, y'all? It is Mike, the movie guy of iWatchMike.com. I checked out a movie, Red Dawn. Mm. What's going on? Let's talk about the movie. It's actually like a reboot remake of the 1984 version Red Dawn starring Patrick Swayze, Leah Thompson, C. Thomas Howe, uh, Charlie Sheen's in this movie. If you haven't seen this movie, it is a classic. That is the reason why when I first heard that they were making this movie, I was like, why? Why are you doing this to my movie Red Dawn? But I have to admit, when I started seeing the cast, Josh Hutcherson from The Hunger Games, Thor, Chris Hemsworth is in this movie. I was thinking, okay, looks pretty cool. There's some hot chicks in there. I think the girl, I can't remember her name, Angerina Pikiliki. Anyways, the hot chick from G.I. Joe. She's in this movie. I was a little worried because, um, because you know, they had some serious big shoes to fill for this movie. And uh, I have to admit, I think the uh, original cast would be proud of the, uh, the new breed of Red Dawn or Wolverines. Chris Hemsworth comes home. He's the United States Marine. He's like this badass Marine. He gets home. He's chilling out with his family. Him and his brother aren't really talking that much because there's a little drama between them. I don't want to give that away. All of a sudden, they wake up to bombs exploding. They look up in the sky and they see parachute men coming down to, to, to attack their little town in, I think it's Washington, I think, or Seattle, somewhere around in that area. All hell breaks loose and people are getting rounded up like cattle. These guys race into their truck and pick up some of their friends and their cops. Their dad's a cop and of the sheriff and he's getting, it's just total chaos and that's why it sounds so crazy. Jay. I know, I see it. Crazy action in the beginning. This movie definitely does have action. I mean, some serious action, gunfire, blowing up stuff. So if you're into those kind of movies, Red Dawn 2012 version is definitely for you. So the story goes on. They become this group of renegade freedom fighters. They call themselves the Wolverines. And they're messing up everybody's program. our freedom. Now it's up to all of us to fight for it. I'm not going to tell you who they are and what they're trying to do or anything else, but just know that they're not fond of the Wolverines messing up their little party of taking over the world. It pretty much becomes a manhunt. And so this whole military force is after the Wolverines. And it's just a big old craziness. And then they find out that the, these evil guys have this thing and then the Wolverines gotta take it and I don't wanna tell too much. How many popcorns do I give it? I'd say three and a half out of five popcorns. Three and a half out of five popcorns for Red Dawn. Make sure you check out my blog, iWatchMike.com and follow me on Twitter at MikeMovieGuy. Peace.